And thank you. A deadly day on Valley train tracks. Two vehicles hit by trains. Two people died. The accidents happening less than seven hours apart. The first in Selma this morning at Floral and Front. And then this afternoon, a driver was struck and killed in Kingsburg at Simpson and Sierra. A.J. Cotto joining us live with more on both of those incidents. A.J. Stephanie, these investigations are ongoing, but police say they believe crossing guards like these ones were down in both cases. They say it's just an important reminder how important it is to stop. Two people dead on Valley train tracks just hours apart. They have the crossing guards for a reason, and it's very important you pay attention and you stop. Around 5 Wednesday, a man in a silver Honda Civic westbound on Sierra crossing Simpson in Kingsburg with a southbound Union Pacific train approaching. The vehicle involved uh, went around the crossing guards and was struck by the train. He died on scene. Police do not believe alcohol or drugs were involved. And people living in the area say they see risky behavior on the tracks. So it happens often. We see that, you know, people try to beat the train. They go around the rails or they're actually sitting on the tracks. Hours earlier, around 1030 in Selma, a similar site. From our information, the gates were down and the lights were working. Two people in this SUV. Police say for unknown reasons, it stopped on the tracks at Floral and Front and was hit by another southbound Union Pacific train. One person died on scene, the other hospitalized. Police now reminding people how dangerous these tracks can be and attempting to cross when it's unsafe is not worth the gamble. Property is replaceable. Um, you know, any injuries you get from this, it's going to take you a while to recover. And the names of these victims have not yet been released. Police also say in at least one of these occasions, the conductor did see the car and try to stop, but they said it was just too late. Live in Fresno, AJ Cotto, KC24, Local News That Matters.